adjusting tonight to life with a cone. Good boy. Seems like he's the same sweet, lovable, loving dog that he always was. It's necessary to keep him from scratching or biting his two incisions. One is on his stomach, where vets say the arrow went in. The other, his back, where it came out. Notice that he was standing in the same place right here, actually, and wasn't walking around. And then I looked closer and saw something sticking out of his back. Thinking he probably hurt himself while playing outside on Tuesday, Molly and Lauren rushed him to the vet. They could not believe what they were told. It's an arrow. Somebody shot your dog. That means somebody had to reach over their high backyard fence to get their shot. He's so friendly. Even if somebody came up to the fence to shoot him, he would have no idea. Hey, how's it going? You know, he'd be trying to like See play with them. Out. The only evidence they have to go off of is the arrow, half of which was snapped off and nowhere to be found in their yard. So that means somebody shot him and then came into our yard and broke it off. Police sent the arrow to the crime lab for testing. As of tonight, there are no suspects. And I even feel unsafe. If somebody would do this to an innocent animal, who knows what they would do to somebody's home or, you know, another human being, us. Now, this happened in the Clabber Creek subdivision just off of Rupal Road in Fayetteville. If you know anything about it, call police.